day 11 of your New Year's resolutions, and you might have either lost some of the holiday weight or just given up and moved on to the next resolution. But for those of you who've thought about throwing in the towel, don't give up just yet because our next guest, Christine Avanti, is here. She's the author of Skinny Chicks Don't Eat Salads. And Christine's here with some great tips to get you thinner in just seven days. And before we get to that, I have to tell you, she knows what she's talking about. You lost 30 pounds doing what you're telling the rest of us to do, and you've kept it off for how long, Christine? I've kept this weight off for about eight years now. Really? And you yeah. came up with the plans yourself as far as eating? Being as concerned and what you Absolutely. Were doing? I did. You know, Audra, I think you know a little bit about this, but way back in the late 90s, there was a death in my family, and I gained right. 30 pounds in six weeks. Couldn't lose it to save my life. Mm -hmm. Tried everything under the sun, every diet, and then I went back to school, got an education in nutrition, and I learned about the power of stabilizing blood sugar, which is eating right. simple meals with proteins and carbs in every meal. And, and we hear this on, on TV a lot, mm -hmm. I think. But I really hope that the viewers understand that if they start combining a protein with a carb in every meal, they will drop weight just from that one tip right there. Right. And the other tips that Christine has, they're not difficult. These are easy to do, so pay attention, right? We're going to yes. start off first with the things that you say that we should not do. No alcohol, no coffee, certain things we should just cut out of our diet altogether and instead have the, the green tea, right? Yeah. You know, starting out, I think just so simple, let's just drink better. So just try to go to water, get away from the alcohol, the, too much caffeine. I mean, two cups of tea in a day is great. Mm -hmm. But also stay away from soda and diet soda because right. diet soda, it's just as bad because it causes more sugar cravings. So I think that is something people should be aware of as well. Right. And then the things to drink are 10 to 12 cups of water a day, two cups of green tea, and then I have like this Diva Detox shot that I like because it like helps that cleanse. Yeah. That's so fun. Cute. And making sure you get eight hours of sleep every single night and then one hour of exercise a day. Definitely yes. important. Yes. Let's get to this drink here. Is this the Diva Detox right here? This is the Diva Detox shot. I created this on my own. Okay. It's a combination of my Skinny Chicks Detox tea, which is in the book, <laughs> and then um, a bunch of vegetables that actually help cleanse the liver. Because mm -hmm. I really believe a detox isn't about starving yourself and fasting. It's about eating healthy meals, right. but then adding in like the Diva Detox shot with the green veggies in there that helps cleanse the liver. And you say people swear by this. Oh, they love my it, right? clients in Hollywood love this. I mean, they love this whole program, and most women are losing five to eight pounds in the first week. Really? Yes. Okay, so now is this for breakfast? This is a good idea for what yeah. we should be eating for breakfast? So on? this is a great example for breakfast. We have egg white scramble with some fruit. Let me tell egg white omelet with some fruit. Let me tell you what I used to eat for breakfast. I used to do a chai latte and a pumpkin scone. How many oh, of us wow. just run to Starbucks and yeah. grab something like that? Yeah. That was when I was heavier. Then I switched over to the egg whites mm -hmm. and some fruit every morning. You have to wake up a little earlier to make it, but it makes a big difference. Right. And then Huge. this here, you said this is kind of hard to find, but once you do find it, stock up on it. This yes. Yogurt. So right. lunch really quick, no cooked meal, Greek yogurt and some fruit and mm -hmm. some nuts. This Vosco's brand Greek yogurt, I like it because you get more protein per container than any other brand. So more bang for right. your buck. Exactly. So I love it. And it's kind of hard to find, but once you find it, it's like you struck gold. So buy cases of it. Okay. I mean, I literally, when I find it, I'm like, give me the boss. Right. Yeah, <laughs> because it it, really, you get so much more protein than other brands. We're I almost like that. out of time, but we let's go through these yep. last two really quick here. Great snack and quick, then also dinner. Quick right? snack. No cook. Again, two light baby belt cheeses, some pop chips. They're not baked. They're not fried. They're actually popped. There's no preservatives. I love them. They're tasty. You don't feel like you're on a diet. Mm -hmm. I love adding a pear to it. And, and then again, the protein. And then for dinner, over there, just salmon, some asparagus. Asparagus, yeah, great right. diuretic. <laughs> right, I learned that too from your book. Yeah, amazing. And some brown rice because you want to make sure you get the protein. So all these meals are about 1,400 calories for the entire day. You stabilize blood sugar. Mm -hmm. I promise you, you start eating foods like this, you will drop quite a bit of weight just in seven days. Well, I know your website is going crazy right about Honestly, yeah. going crazy right about now. But congratulations to you on the book. And Audrey, thanks so thank much for you. stopping by. And if you guys want to get other of Christine's great detox and diet tips, as well as a lot of other healthy meal plans, you can find them on our website, bettertv.com, and just click on the link.